What's up guys, welcome back to another video. My plans for this video was actually to wash the truck and do a little walk around and talk about my truck. But due to the fact that the power is out, it's been out, I think it went out like at four in the morning or so. Uh, I have an electric pressure washer. I, I, I had a gas, but it kept breaking on me. So we did a switch to electric and electric, I guess, gave me a problem too. Anyways, but we're actually gonna be going to a self-service car wash and trying to make the most out of it. Not really detailing it like extremely good, but just like rinsing it down, soaping it down and drying it. And we'll make the most out of it and just take you through my day. So let's roll. We're actually gonna be going to the closest self-service car wash we have by me. It's about eight minutes down the road. And it's usually the one I usually go to just considering how close it is to my house. And yo, so kind of bummed out about the whole pressure washer thing, but we'll be fine. These are my gas stations, my go-to gas stations. I come to these and they happen to have a self-service car wash here, so that makes it a whole lot better. And they have a subway, so if they subway fans, this is your gas station for you. We're gonna run inside and get some change because they actually stopped giving people change here because they had like a break-in, so that sucks. Whoever that was that did that, shame on you. But we're gonna go inside and we'll get started. I got change. Five dollars, baby. Ooh. All right, enough of that. Let's get us into the station. I don't know how good this is actually gonna work. I should probably buy a tripod or something so I can set it up, but we'll make do. Let's bounce. Do we have everything we need? We have a bucket, yes. Wash mitt, yes. Best cleaning supplies ever. Chemical guys, yes. Rag, check. It's a dollar and fifty cents, quarters. Chemical guys, citrus washing glass here. Nice foamy soap. Our mitts in there. And awesome for me, I do have condensation in my headlight. Why? Because they suck and I have to get them resealed. But I gotta send them out to get resealed. I just haven't done it. But other than that, truck's looking better already. So let's get to it. Alright guys, we just finished up soaping up the truck. We're patiently waiting, man. Give it maybe like five or ten minutes for all the soap to dry up. And then no, I'm just kidding, let's go. <laughs> So we're actually about to start drying the truck. It's all cleaned up, washed up. But I want to talk a little bit about my drying towel. This is actually a drying towel from Harbor Freights, and I think Harbor Freights is international, I'm not sure. But if you do, you have to stop and get this. I think it's like an XL plush drying towel or something. It's amazing. It's, it's, it's awesome. 
try it. So we're all finished up, the truck's nice and clean, it's shining, and I guess now it's, it's the right time to do a slow, extra dramatic exit. It's nothing like super crazy, it doesn't roll a whole ton, but I mean it rolls a good amount and uh, that's pretty much what sums up all performance mods that I have on the truck. Change of plans, I forgot Walmart has them for the cheapest price, so Walmart it is. They have a ton of chemical guy stuff if you guys didn't know, but they have a little bit of everything. They have leather quick detailer, leather conditioner. They have interior cleaner. They have waterless waterless car wash, extreme body wash and soap, and a couple of other soaps and stuff like that. But what we actually came for was this. The banana wax spray and the quick detailer. So if you didn't know about Walmart having this stuff, you need to come check it out. Stock up on a couple of your favorite things because they're relatively cheap and I'm pretty sure everybody has a local Walmart so these are the two things we need and let's go but um I do think I'm just gonna wrap up the video here not too much more to see of today but once again you know thank you guys for watching the videos you know make sure to like it subscribe comment your ideas on future videos that you would like to see and 
your ideas and thoughts. Thank you guys once again. I appreciate you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.